Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As usually on Thursday, I show you the Forza Horizon 4 festival playlist and what we can win from new cars and everything. Although I'm still banned, I can get the car for some reason. Um, I got some shadow ban still, but I probably never get unbanned again. But doesn't matter, I can still make videos and give you advice about the cars. As you can see, I am in the new Corvette that we get this week also i didn't do any of the other races because i already have all the cars and it's not interesting for me but as you can see this is the new car there you go so oh almost hit him so let's have a look at the festival playlist now here at 50 percent the toyota supra from 92 and at 80 the mercedes gt4 2018 now here we need to have a picture of Mortimer's garden that's on the playgrounds that is basically here my share is annoying me there you go this is the playgrounds just go into um what is it a modern sports car then the forzaton well sadly i can't show you because that's locked for me thank you turn 10 for doing that but they don't bring exclusive exclusive cars or I mean new cars in that anyway. So if there's any, anyone anything interesting, let me know and I'll tell you if it's okay or not. So here we need to own and drive the Mitsubishi Lancer. Um, 12 speed, 12 stars. There's a total of speed zone. I'll show you the speed zone and then also the dirt racing. I'll also show you that and then just drive. So let's have a look. Let's do the dirt racing and then put the speed zone on. Very simple. The speed zone I always use. Just drive from here to the other side and back. And do that a few times and you will be fine. Then here, uh, to be honest, I don't know if my blueprint is still usable. But at Mud Kickers, I have a blueprint. Um, you sh I think you still can even download my tunes, I don't know. But at Mud Kickers, I have a very short track. Well, basically it's like two seconds. Um, I hope somebody can share the codes in the comments. That would be easy. You just do that and you will be fine. You don't need to waste much time in doing a full, what is it? A full racing event. So you need to do it five times. Uh, so please, if somebody can find my blueprint and share the code, I would be much grateful. Then let's have a look the trial. We can win the BMW Z4. Now, what do we need to do on the trial? I'll put everything off. There you go. We have eight A800 retro sports cars. And it's road racing. So retro sports cars A800. Let's have a look what I have. A class retro sports cars. There you go. Now this is a very good car, but that's a car pass car. This is also a very good car. This one is a little bit better than this one. So you can take this one. Um, Nisbo also a very good car to use This one you can also use I tested it because I found it a very funny car, uh, but it actually Works uh, you can use that car. It has it's very fast in acceleration handling grip and everything It doesn't have a much top speed, but you know the Dravitars um, They can't follow anyway, so I would advise to take this one first then this one then this one and if you have car pass this one then the next one showcase remix that's with the bikes that's old news nothing new um then here playgrounds pontiac from 73 what do we need for the playgrounds i've been playing this game since pre-order so it's almost three years old so i know everything i don't if they never unban me it's fine um there you go b700 classic muscle so let's have a look and then we go to classic muscle where are you classic muscle there you go 
I would take this one. It is a very, very fast car uh, for B-Class. Uh, I think we used it last week in the seasonal. I would advise this one, no matter what. Um, this one is slower, but I would really recommend this one. If you find something better, please always put it in the comments. Then let's have a look here. The PR stunt will do after this. Here is the one that you can win the nice Corvette. So we need B700 Chevrolet. Well, basically you already saw the cars. I don't even know why I'm always going back. You can basically press this one. No. That actually doesn't work. View eligible cars. That doesn't work, Forza. So, B700 Chevrolet. Let's have a look. And then let's take, wait, let's take the B classes and then go to Chevrolet. There you go. Well, basically, the 1967, I find a very good car. Um, it has everything and also very fast acceleration. I started at the finish and five seconds later, all driver tires were behind me. So I would advise taking this car. It's also a very cheap car. Well, basically, they're both cheap. But I really like this one. So I recommend this one. Then let's have a look. This is always a scary one because as long as I play this game, there is not one Bugatti that actually could steer. But let's have a look at the Bugattis um, because I don't think everybody has it. The Devo is one is basically the best Bugatti. So I hope you have it. Um, otherwise, you really need to get it. You can use a Chiron or the Viron, but they don't steer very much. So you need to be careful when you drive it. Um, if your game is on highly skilled, you should be able to win easily with it because somewhere the driver does always slow down anyway. But the Devo is a car that you should use for this. And as you can see, we win the Bugatti Chiron. Then here, the Rally Oop. We win the Ford GT70 from the 70s. And what do we need? A C600 Classic Rally. I would do that race first and then build up to S2 class. Otherwise, you will be flying out. So C600 Classic Rally. Let's have a look. And then we go to Classic Rally. There you go. Well, that are basically all three good cars. Um, Fulvia is basically number one. And uh, this depends. Um, the Volvo and the Lancia are basically a little bit the same. But uh, Fulvia has always been the best car in uh, C-Class for that. So I would advise taking that. Then let's go to the PR stunts. Uh, let's have a look what we need to do. I'll put the seasonal off. So first here, uh, that's a very easy one. We need to have three. Well, that's not really much that we need to do. So let's do this one. I'll just take maybe the new car since I'm sitting in that car. I was playing around with the tuning. I'm not gonna do a very long. As you can see, the driver tires and offline are really annoying. There you go. I can start further away, but oh, don't flip over, please. Well, that was a nice jump. Um, as you can see, the back end is lower. I tuned it a little bit like my Mosler and my Ferrari. 
So that was fine. That was very easy. Then let's go to this. As you all know, I always fail in one of the stunts when I record. I don't uh, eat it. I just go on the fly with my videos. There you go, that's also done, so you can do it in the Corvette. And then here is another one. Now that's a speed trap, um, you need 281, I'm not sure because the gear, the 6 gear is, I didn't tune the gears yet, um, so I'll try. To see if I actually can get it, but I'm probably gonna not have enough speed. But let's have a look. The corner is a little bit annoying. If you have like the muzzler or the Ferrari. Oh. Never mind, I didn't say anything. Um, I need four kilometers, so let's do it one more time. It's always scary when you come in a corner and you don't see something, there's always a Dravatar. Let's try from here. You see the acceleration is good. Fourth gear also. Fifth gear. Oh my god. Well, this is a little of a problem if you, pl if you play offline. Um, you struggle seriously with the Dravatars. But I would take the Mosler. Um, the acceleration is insane. Or the Ferrari. I can go over the grass. And hopefully there's... I already see a Dravatar coming. So I'll just... I missed it. It doesn't really matter. The fact is, you need to come from this side. Um... And you will have it. I can take the muzzle if you want or the Ferrari and I have it instantly. Um, but then again, I am banned and I don't need to finish everything. So that's basically it. Uh, as you can see, the, all the rest is locked. Now, the car here came in S1. Um, I looked at the tuning and there are um, some nice engines in it. Let's have a look quick. So as you can see, I have the 5.2 V10 in it uh, for the for some speed and stuff like that. Just testing. I tested all engines. You have the stock. I'll try to make it like this. So you have. Well, you can basically choose whatever you want. Uh, I know people will want the uh, original engine in that car and I would do that too. Uh, but I was just testing all engines, what it can do and I got stuck on this one. But basically, I was, was hoping there was like a little bit more like a kit or something, but I guess we won't get that. So let's have a look. Um, let's go here. So as you can see, the acceleration is very fast. You have very nice engines, uh, core grip. I didn't tune it for grip. It's basically to see how the acceleration goes of the car. It's, as you can see, it goes really fast. I'm probably gonna hit somebody now. It's not gonna get um, the highest top speed this car, but I think it's gonna be a very good car because. Yeah, there you go. It's really, it's yeah, it's really nice. Um, as you have, if you can have a look at the Corvettes. 
Um, there are several good cars in uh, Chevrolet, like for example the Camaro, this one is good, this one is good. You have a lot of good cars uh, of the manufacturer, so I'm pretty sure that car is going to be very good for racing. I'm going to fine tune it and see what it can do. But that's it for now. Uh, also, although I didn't do everything on gold, um, it, I can't do the trial or playgrounds or online adventures, so I will never ever get 80%. But it's like if I wouldn't have uh, live gold from Xbox or whatever, I couldn't go online anyway, but still get the new car. So that's fine. Well, that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.